Hey everyone! Today we're going to unravel the intricacies of disabling VPNs on your iPhone or iPad. Now, VPNs are fantastic for enhancing your online privacy and breaking through geo restrictions, but let's face it, sometimes they can be more of a hindrance than a help. If you're experiencing slow internet speeds or dealing with malfunctioning apps, turning off your VPN might be the solution you're looking for. So first off, most VPN providers like NordVPN, ExpressVPN or CyberGhost offer user-friendly apps with easy to find disconnect buttons. Open the app, tap on that button and you're good to go. You'll know you successfully disconnected when the VPN icon vanishes from your status bar or control center. If you're not a fan of using third-party apps, no problem, Apple has you covered. Go to your settings app, look for the VPN switch and toggle it off. Just remember, if your VPN automatically reconnects, you need to disable the Connect On Demand feature. To do this, open General in the Settings app, scroll down to VPN and Device Management and select it. Tap on the VPN you want to disconnect, then tap the info icon next to your VPN configuration. Toggle off Connect On Demand. If you've decided that you and your VPN are better off seeing other people, long press on the app icon and then tap on Remove App and confirm with Delete App. But what if you want to take it a step further? How about completely erasing all traces of your VPN? Head over to Settings, then General, then VPN and Device Management. Tap VPN, tap Info next to your VPN profile, and finally, tap Delete VPN. Just a word of caution, don't forget to cancel any paid subscriptions related to your VPN for your Apple ID settings. Turning off your VPN might solve some problems, but keep in mind it exposes you to various risks. Your online activity becomes vulnerable to tracking and hacking, particularly on unsecured Wi-Fi networks. So weigh the pros and cons before going commando on the web. And that wraps it up. Whether you're troubleshooting or simply taking a break, now you know how to safely disable or completely erase a VPN on your iPhone or iPad. If you found this guide useful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more tech insights. Until then, see you next time.